Cancer, welcome. Goodbye 2022. It's out with the old and it's in with the new. And we want to see what old is being released from you at this time as you move into a complete new cycle. Also, we want to see um, what is not working that has happened that is not traveling with you into this new space and new energy. Spirit guides, can you show us what we need to see? Let's get in here for you. Remember, this is a general reading. If it resonates with you, please do let me know. Hit the thumbs up button. If not, please do release the reading. Um, if you uh, do not find that you resonate with this one, you can also go check your rising moon and Venus. If you want a personal reading with me, you can contact me. Email is below in the description box. Interesting. We've got grounding that has come up here. Let me get the other cards out for you. A little heads up. I'm only doing the reversals in this reading. I want to see what is not serving you anymore and what is going to be released. So with the grounding energy, it does say go deep and explore your roots. So um, there's a stagnant vibe coming from this energy. Even though it's not a negative energy, I just feel like it's a quiet. Look how this person's just sitting there by themselves under a tree all alone kind of like in their own world reading a book over there so we've got the star card coming in reverse energy oh hello we've got one card that's shown up in the upright hello ah that's interesting we've got a nine of cups there as well ha ah. and we have got a temperance card caution a little bit of caution showing up here. I feel like you're very, very concerned with stability in your life. Interesting that this shows up as grounding. And then we've got the Knight of Pentacles coming in. I feel like you're being very, very, very cautious with your life. Okay. It's almost as if you are um, being so careful with temperance coming in here because of negative things that you've experienced in your past. So there is growth happening in your life here, but the growth that is taking place. Um, especially with regards to like financial growth or career growth is very, very slow. And I feel like you're being very, very cautious here. There is something here with temperance, which is Sagittarius, that you do not want to um, repeat again, like a negative experience. I feel like it's tied to somebody... Um, I nearly said abusing you, <laughs> abusing your good heart. I hope, no, you didn't have a very negative relationship or anything like that, but it did pop in. And I almost feel as if you gave your heart and soul to somebody here, or you've been giving so much of yourself to everybody. And it's a very kind of like selfish energy coming back towards you. It's almost as if you give and give and give to people and they do not give back to you. And I feel like this is what has caused you to kind of um, go into like this hermit feeling um, where you're kind of protecting yourself. You don't want to be used by people. You don't want to be hurt by people. So you've kind of cut yourself off here a little bit in your energy. The star card showing up, it, it feels as if certain dreams or certain hopes that you've had for your life you've almost given up on it it's as if you said no i don't think this is going to happen for me um i'm just going to let this go i'm just going to stay in my own little world and mind my own business and i don't want anything negative to come in i feel like to be honest with you as 20 the new year comes in i feel like it's an energy that you're kind of leaving behind i honestly feel as if you're going to be taking a few new risks during this year it may feel like risks to you i feel as if you're stepping out of your cocoon a little bit here you're stepping out of your your how you want how you've been expressing your life in 2022 it's almost as if you went into lockdown in 2020 and you is it 20, 2019 we went in lockdown i don't remember anymore it's so many so long ago it's almost as if you yeah it's 2020 it's almost as if you uh went into that stage of being isolated like that and you never came out of it again. I feel like this year you're coming out of your cocoon. You're really um, emerging as a butterfly here where you are going to be. It's almost like you're coming out like that. You know what I mean? I feel like you're, really, you're going to be showing a new you to the world. And let me tell you something. The dreams that you've always wanted to have and the new goals that you want to have, you might even have new ones, to be honest with you. But there we go. I feel like you are leaving caution behind you a little bit. You're coming out of your cocoon and this energy where absolutely nothing has been happening almost like this hermit stagnant energy that is going to be leaving you throughout the entire year thank you so much for watching do stay safe tonight if you are going to go out there and have some fun do so safely have a good time and i'm sending blessings for you and abundance for you and happiness and joy towards you for your new year thank you so much for watching bye